so these two are actually the most customizable custom rooms out there and i think so a lot of users have already tried out we're talking about ancient ways version 7.0 and basically ancient ways and rise Droid. both of these custom rooms are almost same identical in, th in terms of customizations you already know that but we'll find out some of the major changes or some of the differences between these custom rooms and at the last i will tell you that which custom room i will prefer and why here is the default thing first of all this is the default launcher you will see almost same things in both of the devices in both of the custom rooms and no major changes both of these custom launchers are same as you can see if i move on to the miscellaneous options here is only what i found like suggestions and background blur depth and not a major change things are almost same in both of these both of these custom rooms there might be some of the minor changes here and there and if you're able to notice both of these launchers are actually based on launcher 3 the sushi launcher is based from sea android which is also based on launcher 3 as far as i know and ancient is just ancient if i move on to quick settings panel as expectedly both of the devices will give you the light quick settings panel if you use the light mode and if you use the dark mode you will see the dark quick settings panel so this is almost identical here you can see the edit icon is there at the top and edit icon is at the bottom respectively in ancient OS and rise Stride. if i move on to the security options you will be able to notice both of these devices have the app lock option available for you although yes in my right i'm using realme c3 which is not having the fingerprint sensor that is why the fingerprint option is not showing but the things are almost same here too in the security options face unlock and app lock if I move on to the wallpapers and styles options, you'll be able to notice both of these custom rooms also support uh, custom themed icons. So if you want to use lawn icons, theme files icons, DG, RK, whichever icon you want to use, you can use them. The option is present here for you. And as they both have the same launcher, so you can see the grid options are almost same here in both of these. You can see 2x2 or up to 6x10. Here is the thing which is about customization, a lot of customization options, both of these custom rooms. And if I talk about all of those customizations, I don't think so I will be able to cover all these customizations in a single video because these are a lot. And by the way, you already know some of the customizations are just for customization purposes, but not for use. If I move on to the theming options in ancient OS, you can see the quick settings have this theming option. And one of my favorite feature is this one where you can use the quick setting styles. Other options, ancient OS also gives you the option to use the settings base as one UI style, which if you move on to the settings options, you can see whenever you open any menu, you will see the one UI style UI in every sub menu. So this is the thing. And while as if I move on to the Rise Droid custom room, this also brings you this quick setting styles option which is available in ancient os 2 you can see and yes both of these looks good and one more thing if you are able to notice the brightness difference don't worry it's just normal because realme c3 in my device the brightness is just not up to the mark but it's fine the rise droid also gives you these options theming engine which includes the setting styles system style theming settings and lock screen styles some things might be different in rise droid and some things might be different in ancient ways but almost same kind of ui one major change which i found here is in the setting style if you're able to notice about phone style in ancient os and about phone style in rise droid if i enable the option and you can see the about phone style in rise droid is actually in the home page in settings home page where you will see this device ui and if i move on to the about phone in ancient os this is how the ui is looking like oxygen OS style of ui looks damn interesting and from my point of view i think so ancient os is giving you better ui if i compare it with rise droid for now also if you move on to the ancient OS, you can see you can even customize the switches and this option is actually not present in ancient not present in rise droid sorry for that rise droid is not including this feature this thing is already present in ancient OS, and you can see this is just kind of for fun if i move on to the data icon style options you can see you can even customize this one these we have options available like faint ui one two three four plumpy and some more almost same kind of ui one thing which i didn't found in ancient os is this power menu styles maybe i was not able to find it somewhere maybe it, it is there i'm not sure but i didn't found the option is present in rise where you can see you can customize the power menu there are many power menu options available you can see if you want to and if you want to use android 7 style android 8 style android 12 style or you have these options available these power menu options are quite good and i think so i will use this thing 
if i move on to one more option called scarlet services this option is also not present in ancient to is what this is it is just for optimizing the device power consumption and performance while device is in idle and the second one is system boost where you can boost your system for faster and fluid user experience according to them this might work this might not also one major difference i will tell you later on stay tuned but i found a major change and major difference in both of these custom room ui style is also the thing which is present in ancient os and not present in rise droid i think so might be there but i didn't found because rise droid is already having a lot of theming options but ancient os gives you this kind of option if you have noticed my if you have watched my previous video regarding bootleggers os bootleggers is actually having the, these options the theming options one more thing is if i move on to the ancient theming options ancient customization options you can see you can customize these things and these things looks good just for customization purpose not a major deal and it also includes a lot of customizations regarding miscellaneous i mean netflix spoof unlimited photo storage etc it also have the option to customize the settings ui settings ui the option is present in rise droid also but according to me ancient is giving you better option in the terms of settings ui customization according to just just according to me of course it's user's preference if i move on to this option you can see this tab layout looks damn cool and yes it's very easy to access all these customizations with this tab layout according to me this is about these things this is about uh, these customizations which i found in rise droid and ancient os both of these custom rooms brings a lot of customizations these are some other major difference uh, these are some actually major same changes actually parallel space which is available in both of these custom rooms rise droid ancient os you can use parallel space in both of these custom rooms it also includes a google services option which both these custom rooms bring if you use rise droid you will see this option if you use ncos you will see this option but here is the major change major thing which i found if you use the rise droid custom room the thing is it's available officially it's available unofficially for you too i mean if your device does not support that you will still be able to use that because rise droid unofficial versions are there or maybe your device community is having the developer where you can build this thing for your device but if you want to use ancient os and if it is not officially available for your device you will not be able to use that because that is private source so keep this thing in mind this is the major difference by the way because if you if you if that custom room is not available for your device you can't use unofficial too so this is a major difference but the things which i just want you to let you know i have already shared with you this is all thanks for watching make sure to like and share this video goodbye